Good morning, everyone. This is Bill Henderson, Chief Investment Officer from Valley National Financial Advisors, giving you a quick update on last night's election. If you were like me, you only got a couple of hours of sleep. My prediction was correct that we were going to have a decisive victory one way or the other. I didn't pick a side, but we see it has been the Republicans with Donald Trump winning the presidency. The one thing to remember is the Senate, although it is now in the hands of the Republicans, it is not filibuster proof. So big legislative things have to get agreed upon by both parties. Everyone needs to understand that. So I think that's really important to take into context of what's going to happen over at least the next two years. It does give Trump a mandate to come up with things. He wants to use tariffs as a bargaining chip with our adversaries overseas. I think that is just a way to get people to the table and make decisions. It doesn't mean there's going to be huge tariffs on goods and services. So we have to pay attention to that. Let's not overlook the economy. The economy is still doing really well. That's the U.S. economy. I would not lose focus of that. That is what's fueling the, the stock market. The higher yields we're seeing on bonds is probably a reflection of the lack of fiscal discipline that either neither Trump nor Harris were going to give us. So we're probably going to continue to see that. Um, lastly, tomorrow is a Fed meeting. It's on a Thursday. Jay Powell is going to give a press conference. Markets are pricing in a 25 basis point rate cut. We'll probably give an update on that sometime in the next week or so. But I think it is important to remember rates are coming down. The economy is doing well. And we will see substantial things coming out of the government over the next several years. Thank you.